guys I'm outside in uh, Taiwan Taipei right now and again what do you think of when you think of Taiwan you think of night markets so today I was told I should go take a look at the night markets here um, it's changed a lot but I'm not sure actually I haven't actually been there yet um, so I have been to one in Taichung and it actually looked really 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 busy so I can't imagine this being any different but because I haven't gone yet, I'm actually walking there right now. I thought I'd take a look and see what it is. Generally, there's a lot of people, a lot of food, a lot of stalls. Not quite sure what's going on today, but it doesn't seem like there's a lot of people. Now saying that, it is a weekday, but I remember pre-COVID, there used to be a lot of people even during the weekdays. So we're going to see and we'll get back to you. So here we are coming into the night market it's 10 30 at night so it should be bustling right now and oh my goodness it's like dead there's like no one here um it is a side entrance so it's just off the main road but as you can see as you get further in you're going to see that there's a lot of stores that are closed a lot of booths that have disappeared i don't know First time in a while, but we'll see. In theory, we're coming into the more busier part of the night market. And as you can see, there's not a lot of people. This is generally where most of the food that I used to buy are, right? There's a temple that I would, you know, come take a look and stop by every once in a while. I mean, generally over here, it used to be packed to the point where you can you couldn't get in you'd be shoulder to shoulder everywhere right now it's, it's basically empty again 10 35 at night and completely empty I don't know I'm looking for something to eat so we'll figure it out we're coming into the main road of the night market and again a lot of stores are closed everything is empty i'm surprised that they're so empty now a lot of booths are closed there's a for rent sign i'm actually kind of hungry so i want to go eat something I'm not quite sure i can get some food but again i usually do take a uh, shortcut into a smaller market but unfortunately I don't see it right now because I'm just so not used to all the empty space all right but I can just tell you this these COVID restrictions really killed this place it's not what it used to be again an Adidas store is closed right now alleyways that were all packed are completely cold closed it's amazing what a little bit of COVID can do, right? More closed doors, more closed doors. Anyways, if I find something I can eat, I will call you, I will start recording again. I'm coming up to the main food section. And as you can see, most of the stalls are closed. I cannot believe that it's closed right now. But anyways, I'm a little hungry. I'd like to get a sausage. So let's go see what I can find. Or not. It doesn't look very good, so I'll keep moving. Holy crap, there's like no one here. It's dead. Oh, my favorite, takoyaki's closed. Ooh. nothing I really want to eat so I guess I'll sign off now because there really is nothing I want to eat so at the night market I missed my fried chicken and so I thought I'd get some fried chicken today for lunch here's a take -o. here's a look at what it is the chicken wings the chicken legs are all frying 
It's going to take about 12 minutes, but it looks good. Can't wait to try it. As I'm waiting for my food, I'm not watching him prepare. The advantage of having it in Taiwan is they're going to weigh everything. So you know exactly how much you get all the time. So what he's doing now is he's prepping the uh, food in bags. I think this one's a tempura, fish cakes. And then he weighs it, make sure that it's always the same weight before he cooks it. That way you don't feel like you've been skimped on the food. So this is what I got. Fried chicken legs, fried chicken pieces, and some french fries. So if you look at it, oh, she just ate it. Oh no, she just ate it. So let me grab a piece and I'll show you guys. Popcorn chicken. Bum bum. Popcorn chicken, a Taiwan delicacy. We tried to go to Monga, but they were closed. So this is what we got. How to get eat? Yeah. And that's it. Didn't get a good shot, so I'm at home right now. Here's the chicken nuggets and popcorn. And there's a chick piece of chicken. Hey, <coughs> yep. You generally add some pepper. This is spicy pepper or cayenne pepper. But we added the other one. Hi. And this is my niece, Cindy, eating the fries and the chicken.